people remain in broken marriages and they don't get anybody involved and they don't fix what's broken and they develop hatred towards each other. And then they, when that hatred is towards between husband and wife, the children see it. And they learn that this is normal. It's normal for mom and dad to talk this way. So when they, those kids grow up and they're going to be married, guess how they're going to talk to their spouse? That's what they learned. That's the schooling they got at home. So when you don't have that peace at home, you are actually passing that chaos down to the next generations. And, you, and it's a subconscious kind of learning. You know, when, when children learn from what they see, that is never forgotten. What they learn in classroom, you forget. You, you, you know, you guys, when you were kids, you don't remember what your teacher said in the class. You remember one thing, what your, what your parents used to do at home, you remember. <laughs> you remember that. You still, as adults, you remember that. Because that, that leaves an imprint on a person's personality. So this isn't just about even a husband and a wife. It's about the legacy we're leaving behind. The, the, you know, the, the, the tranquility that's supposed to come thereafter. If you keep suffering from abuse silently, then you are actually, you're part, partly responsible for what's happening. And not just to you, what's happening to your children or future generations. Right? And it, because it, it's not okay to live in resentment with somebody else. It's not okay to look at somebody else and remember all the hurt they caused you all the time. It's not okay to not be at peace. The fundamental purpose of marriage was لِتَسْكُنُوا إِلَيْهَا Before Allah mentioned love, before He mentioned care, mawadda wa rahmah, He said the first purpose of marriage is so you can find peace with each other. When you look at someone, you just calm down and relax. Like finally I'm in a safe place. Finally this is a place where I'll be dignified, I won't be humiliated, I won't be reminded of my past mistakes, I won't be, I'm completely at ease because I'm in the presence of my spouse, husband or wife. If that's not there, then that needs to be there. And if that's not, if you're not able to get there yourself, then you need outside help and professional help at that.